There he is. What a world. Welcome back. I am Dwayne Langham. This is the app, YOLO app, the road leash traveled. And you have just tuned in for another exciting conversation. Today's video, I want to share a concept. It's about integrity, baseline integrity, about how we don't stay constant in life. We're either moving forward, climbing up the hill, or you are backsliding. I only live once, that's the motto, nigga, YOLO. Okay, now what do I mean by that? Baseline integrity. Well, first, let's get integrity clear, right? Integrity is your word. Remove any consideration of integrity being about morality. It doesn't make you right or wrong. It doesn't make you a good or bad person. But integrity is more or less the foundation that gets traction in your life to make things happen, to get things moving. What that means is that what you say you're going to do happens when you say you're going to do it. Integrity, that's it. A lot of times in life, we say things. We want to do something. We'd like to do something. We even promise to do something. But what happens when it doesn't happen? You see, that's what I mean when I say baseline integrity. Because life will continue no matter what. Whether you do it or not. Whether you keep your promise, whether you follow through, whether you get it done, life's going to keep going. So it's very easy to let it slide. Oh, I, I didn't follow through. I didn't make it to the meetup. I didn't come through with the promise. I wasn't able to do what I said I was going to do. And the clock keeps ticking. So what happens with that is our baseline drops. I know the baseline part may be a little confusing. Say, for example, you say you're going to spend some quality time with your kids once a week. That's your promise. That's the effort, the intention that you set out for so you guys can grow a bond and get closer. Or say it's just someone important in your life. I'm going to pick up the phone and call my parents once a week. You call them for the most part a couple weeks in a row. One week it doesn't happen. Life keeps going. You get consistent, get back on it, call them another couple weeks then it doesn't happen again. So let's say as far as performance, your baseline is at about 80%. Most of the times you're calling, but 20% of the time, you're not gonna call. Life still works, you're still connecting, but what you said you're going to do is not happening when you said it was going to happen on a weekly basis. Your baseline drops, so now your performance is about 80%. Because 80% works, life still continues, and that becomes your normal, guess what? It dropped from 100%. It's going to drop from 80%. As long as life works, as long as that's the minimal effort that you can do, you're going to do that. So then 80% all of a sudden knocks down to 60% and so forth. You keep backsliding until you've got integrity more at about 30%. Of course, at that point, it becomes more apparent. You may not know it's integrity, but you can't figure out why you can't get progress. Why the business hasn't picked up off the ground. Why your ideas don't seem to be happening. Why you can't get traction in life. Why things aren't moving around you. Why your relationships are falling apart, not staying connected and in contact. Why your word is no longer law, your world. That's powerful, isn't it? That's the importance of integrity. That's the importance of keeping that baseline integrity to the max. Because you have to realize, it's not just about the promises that you're making to other people. It's not just about when you're coming through on your word. Like I said, this has nothing to do with morality. It's not about right or wrong. It's more important. If you can't keep your word with others, guess what? You're not keeping your word to yourself. How many times have you told yourself, New Year's resolutions, next week we're going to get on it. Tomorrow we're going to start that program. I'm going to run that business tomorrow, next month, Monday. All those promises unkept. Take a log of your life. I invite you to consider how many promises have you made to yourself that have not been fulfilled? And where has that left you in your life? Does the world keep spinning? Absolutely. But does your life live powerfully in a life that you love? I invite you to consider that. Drop some comments below. Tell me your experiences. What's life like when you're in integrity? When you just get things done, when you just do it, where it doesn't matter how you feel, doesn't matter what's going on in your life, what struggles may be happening, if you're tired, if things come up or get in the way, but you make sure to get it done. We'll continue the series talking about how to get back into integrity, how to get yourself together. This one, I just want to get you familiar with the concept and idea of integrity and where you see integrity is important in your life. Now make sure you go out there and be powerful today because on my word and in my integrity, I promise you that today is the best day of your life. It's the only one you got. I love it when you like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, I'm wishing you the best and only success. Peace. Anything else you want to say? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Mm-hmm. <laughs>